Hi guys, welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to reset Windows 8.1 without losing your data. So over time, programs will get installed on your computer and this means that more demand for resources on your machine and this means that Windows will over time get slower and this is true on any operating system so eventually you may want to reinstall Windows in Windows 8.1 there is a way of doing it without actually losing your data you can do it in Windows 7 and Windows Vista without losing your data however Windows 8.1 makes it much easier so to begin with we need to log on to Windows 8.1 So this version of Windows is 8.1 Enterprise and basically it's installed within a virtual machine. So to reset Windows 8.1 what we need to do is go to the right hand corner to the charms and to the settings uh, charm. Next we need to go to the change PC settings and this is obviously like the mini sort of control panel which is the metro base. So on the left hand side there are several options and what we need for recovery is the update and recovery option. So next we choose the recovery option on the left hand side and this uh, window will appear and basically it says refresh your PC without affecting your files that is an option to reset your machine, that's one we're going to use but there's also remove everything and reinstall Windows so that will mean that all your data and everything will be lost whereas if you go with this option uh, photos, music, videos and other files will be kept and then there is a third option as well which allows you to go to advanced startup to diagnose your machine so for now we're going to refresh your PC without affecting files. So if we hit getting started and while it says please wait preparing, what it's basically doing is preparing the image for Windows 8.1 so that it can reinstall over itself. So next Windows will show a summary of what's going to happen. So it says refresh your PC and it's going to keep the files and personalization settings. It's saying that the PC settings will be changed back to their defaults the apps from the Windows Store will be kept, however apps that you've installed from disks or websites as in uh, desktop apps rather than metro apps will be removed and a full list of removed apps will be saved on your desktop so if we agree that that's what we want to happen we can click next and it gives us a full list of apps that we need to reinstall so as you can see there's Java multi-bit and VMware tools that we really need reinstalling so that will be saved on the desktop once reinstalled so if we hit next and it gives just a general information that's saying it'll take a few minutes for Windows to refresh your PC and it'll basically restart so if we hit refresh So now your PC will restart and as you can see it's saying preparing to refresh your PC.
So Windows has now rebooted and has now been reset. So if we log in, And then Windows boots back into the Metro UI. And as we can see, as it said, it's put a desktop shortcut to the removed apps page. And it basically tells us what has been removed since the last install. And in the documents folder, we still have the data folder that I created beforehand with the test file in. So once you've reinstalled, you'll need to reinstall your drivers and make sure that you update your machine. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, rate, comment and subscribe and check out my website at benstechtips.co.uk.